Good afternoon. Welcome to Jim Munley's World of Weather. Clicked on to long range weather forecast discussion for September 13th to 27th. For September 13th to 17th, we have a zone of flow forecast across the northern states and we have a ridge across the southern states, much, uh, southern states and much of the country will be dry. The exception will be a portion of the Gulf Coast due to a possible tropical development and we'll look at that at the surface. We're going to start here. We see uh, area rain down in the southwest Gulf of Mexico. And then we see on, on the 13th, we'll go back to this map. It jumped a little bit. And you can see we have this low here that will move northward. And this will spread heavy rain here along the Gulf Coast of um, the western and central Gulf Coast. Now, the exact path will determine where the heaviest rain will fall, whether it goes further east or is more to the south or to the west. Okay, um, we're going to go back to the surface maps. And um, also, for now, expect the heaviest rain, like I told you, to be along the central western Gulf Coast. And we'll have ser uh, several frontal boundaries moving across the northern states that will bring some uh, light rain to the central and eastern part of the country. Take a look at the period for um, September 18th to 22nd. Nearly zone of flow is forecast across much of the nation. A crop is forecast. You go back here. I went too far. To fast forward, uh, trough forecast over the northwest, zone of flow above normal heights, near to above normal heights across uh, the eastern states. Here's our ridge, Western Atlantic Ridge. So, um, this looks um, within agree. This this looks pretty good in agreement with the teleconnection that's occurring over the um, eastern. Uh, over eastern Asia, we have this strong ridge here over this area that's causing for the warmer weather in the east. So I'm calling for this forecast period. Below normal temperatures here. Calling for anomalies of 2 to 6 degrees below normal. Above normal temperatures forecast for much of this region. And anomalies of up to 12 degrees above normal, basically in this um, this red area. And for precipitation, calling for below normal precipitation for this, for the Rockies. Probability of occurrence 35 to 40%. And we have above normal precipitation forecast of much of this area here. Probability of occurrence is 35 to 40%. Looking ahead to the period for September 23rd to 27th. Um, there seems to be some progression in the flow, but all in all, we're expecting a little change in the height anomalies. Some of the models push the uh, trough further into the Mississippi Valley, Great Lakes area. Some have, you know, see, so you can say, oh, whoops, European Ensembles has it down in through the Mississippi Valley region above New Heights here and along the West Coast. So for this forecast period for now, is subject to change. Now it was just working and now it's not. I'm calling for little change in the temperature anomalies from the previous period and for precipitation calling for below normal precipitation from much of the Rockies and the probability of occurrence is 35 to 40 percent. And we have above normal precipitation forecast for this region, and the probability of occurrence is near 40%. That's a long range weather forecast discussion for September 13th to 27th. Thanks for coming to Jim Only's World of Weather, and have a good day.